Hi Excelers, welcome to another Excel video tutorial. Today we're going to use Excel to pick a random winner from our list of competition entries and we're going to use index and run between formulas. So let's get started. So today I'm going to show you how to pick a random winner using two formulas in Excel, the index and run between. And we're going to pick the winner from our collection of names here who have entered a competition. We've got 10 names. So the first part of the formula is index. So what does index do? Basically, it gives us the value or the reference to a value from within a table or a range. Well, we have a range here, B5 to B14. It could easily use be a table. Let's go ahead and start the formula as ever with equals. And let's type index. And as usual, Excel gives us a, a little help there and says, Index returns a value or reference of the cell at the intersection of a particular row and column in a given range. Let's go ahead, open parentheses, and we'll select our range or our array. Hit comma, and it's asking for which row number you, do you want to return? Right here. OK, let's just say row number one. Close parentheses, hit enter. And that's Jane. Let's go ahead and change that and say it's row 10, which is Steve. We can combine this with rand between to get Excel to pick a random name for us and pick a winner for our competition. So what we need to do is strip this back and type this part of the formula is rand between. And again, Excel tells us what this formula does. It returns a random number between the numbers that you specify. OK, let's open the parentheses. So it's asking us for a top and a bottom number. So our bottom and top number is 1 and 10. Row 1, row 10 in our range of cells. So let's hit 1 and 10. Close parentheses, close parentheses again, hit OK. This time it's picked at random, Laura. If you want to recalculate, just highlight your cell, hit F9, and it'll keep randomly generating more random names. By hitting F9, we're forcing Excel to manually recalculate that cell. If you want the practice file for this video, click on the link below. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, comment, thumbs up, and I'll see you next time for another How to Excel at Excel video.